The Marvels movie is an absolute disaster so far. Every single piece of promotional material they've put up for this film have gotten ratioed. People are talking about this movie and there really seems to be zero hype behind it. But now that the final trailer is out, people are calling it out for their desperate attempt to market this movie. I have a few different things that I want to show off, but before we get into the topic, if you enjoy the content I create, check out the links in the description, follow me on social media, and consider supporting through Patreon or via YouTube memberships. Now, this is a movie that I personally have had absolutely no hype for. I will see it because I'm a content creator, but that is the only reason why. This movie just doesn't look very good. Okay, this cast of characters doesn't sound awesome. You've got uh, the gender-swapped villain. You've got Captain Marvel, played by Brie Larson that nobody likes. You've got Miss Marvel, an irrelevant character who's been in one piece of content, which was her own show. And then you have uh, Monica Rambeau, who is important to Captain Marvel's story, but really not that important to the MCU in totality. And we know that this is going to be a woman power to the Max film, not only because almost all of the main characters are females, but we also found out that Valkyrie is going to be in this movie, so they really crammed it with as many strong women as they possibly could. But now that the final trailer is out, people are absolutely roasting them for trying to use these top-tier characters to market this very shitty movie. Okay, they are trying to use characters like Captain America and Tony Stark to try and bring people into this film, and it is not going to work, okay? You might put Thanos in your trailer, but that doesn't mean it's a Thanos-level event. The hype that was surrounding the Infinity War saga was so massive, and since then, the MCU just hasn't been the same, and these, you know, very strong, independent women aren't going to save you, and I do think that the MCU really is caving in around them. I genuinely think that the execs thought that this is what was going to sell, that everyone was going to absolutely love this, but it hasn't really worked. I mean, I like some of the females in the MCU, don't get me wrong. Uh, you know, Black Widow was cool for a time. Her movie was very bad. Uh, WandaVision was kind of cool at the start, but unfortunately by the end, it kind of lost its steam. There decent characters, don't get me wrong, but at the same time, when you are teaming up the most insufferable of them all, you really aren't going to get anyone interested in this piece of content. And right now, this final trailer that they really threw in all the stops, they threw in, again, uh, Iron Man, Captain America, Thanos, this is the movie uh, that they that they tried to create after, you know, those amazing characters were done in the MCU. Uh, it is just a disappointment appointment, okay, to these characters' legacies. They really thought that marketing the film this way was going to be good, but even that is getting destroyed because people are calling them out for using these, you know, S-tier actors and characters to promote these D-list uh, level characters, but it's currently sitting at 74,000 likes to 91,000 dislikes, so it is very quickly approaching 100k dislikes at 4.2 million views. You would think that they would have a bit more interaction than this, but you know, the days of Marvel projects just getting massively positively ratioed are are seemingly over. And the comments, ooh, the comments are brutal. Of course, you do have the rings of power formula here, but there's a lot of people that are simply commenting how there is zero hype behind this. Y'all remember the hype for every movie leading up to Infinity War? Good times. Those truly were the good days. I used to love the MCU, and I know so many of you feel the same way, but unfortunately, they just have lost uh, that touch when it comes to this. They have not been able to capture that magic. As long as there are those who remember what was, there will always be those who cannot accept what can be absolutely 
fantastic Thanos quote. Disney must be very desperate putting Iron Man and Captain America in trying to save this movie. It's really like they're trying to bait the normies into watching this. Like, oh my god, it's been it's been a couple of years since I've seen an MCU project. You know what? If they're referencing these amazing characters, surely they must have uh, you know, a lot of confidence in the ones that are in this film, but that could not be further from the truth. We have heard that Marvel is unsure what they are going to really be doing next because they thought that these female characters were going to work out. It's like Captain Marvel. They thought that she was going to be a massive hit because her own film in 2019 made over a billion dollars, but now that this movie is coming out, they have truly uh, learned to accept the fact that people really dislike her. And uh, there's really no way to save this character or any of these characters, to be honest. I just don't see a cast of characters here that really has any potential. Uh, for those who don't know, this trailer currently has 70k likes and 80k dislikes, and this was only seven hours ago. Uh, yeah, putting 30 seconds of old Avengers from total two-minute trailer shows how confident the MCU is. Yeah, like, you would think they would use every single second in this very short trailer to market these characters to get people excited for this movie but instead they have to bank on these different characters bank on the nostalgia and i feel like a lot of people uh that you know have not maybe followed the mcu all that closely over the past few years might see this trailer go and see this movie and then be wildly disappointed when they find out that really none of the uh the characters from the mcu that was are here except for i guess valkyrie and of course uh nick fury those are the only two that you can really say were part of the older mcu the good mcu days um but yeah i mean not none of these lead females are going to do the trick and again this is just one trailer the final trailer that's getting ratioed uh the last one from seven days ago well it's a clip it's got fifteen thousand likes to 20k dislikes and then the official uh trailer that they've been promoting heavily on social media 21 million views 275,000 likes to 307,000 dislikes so none of these trailers have been going well for them everything surrounding this movie has been a nightmare so far for marvel and disney and i can't say i'm that all that surprised i think that this movie is going to absolutely tank at the box office the estimates say that this movie is going to have an atrocious open weekend it's going to be the worst in the mcu's history and honestly the spot could not be taken by a worse movie they deserve all of that and more and i do genuinely hope that this movie flops but that's all that i really had to discuss in this video let everyone know your thoughts in the comment section down below if you enjoyed this and of course found it important and informative make sure to give it a like share it and subscribe to the channel and of course if you didn't make sure to give it a dislike i appreciate your support either way but i will talk to you all again in the next video really soon